In honor of his birthday, today's Cranbrook Deep Dive is dedicated to Shepard Ferry. Influential street artist Shepard Ferry has been a consistent presence in national and international art scenes since the 1990s. The LA-based artist is best known for his ubiquitous Hope image created originally as a grassroots activism tool to support Barack Obama's 2008 presidential campaign. His We the People poster series for the 2017 Women's March was also a pervasive icon created for social change. Ferry also created a mural in Detroit at One Campus Martius, making his work locally renowned in the city of Detroit. In summer 2018, Cranbrook Art Museum hosted an exhibition of his work titled Shepherd Ferry Salad Days 1989-1999. The exhibition focused on the first 10 years of Ferry's artistic practice and explored the roots of graphic language and philosophies of the punk scene. This print in our collection, also titled Salad Days, was created by Ferry as a limited edition print exclusively for the solo exhibition at Cranbrook Art Museum, yet the design and imagery have roots that go back to the start of Ferry's artistic practice. While still a student at the Rhode Island School of Design in 1989, Shepard Ferry created the first Andre the Giant Has a Posse sticker by stenciling an image of professional wrestler Andre Rene Rusimov, aka Andre the Giant, from a newspaper. The image would soon gain iconic status as it spread hand-to-hand -hand via friends and fans who pasted it up on city streets across the United States and eventually around the world. It was one of the most successful grassroots viral campaigns taking place well before the advent of social media. Andre the Giant has a posse transformed into the Obey Giant icon in the mid-1990s, which Ferry uses in this print. Ferry's inclusion of the ominous command, Obey, was inspired by John Carpenter's 1988 sci-fi horror cult film, They Live, which is about subliminal messages implanted in everyday life to elicit mind control. It tasks viewers to reconsider the ease with which they read and accept ideas within an information-driven world.